process one by one. There were also hopes for healing. I wish for my brother's good health and his treatment to be very successful. Family, health, and happiness. Three, two, one, hop! Each tiny piece, a big dream for a brighter future. My wish is for God to surround me with great people. My wish is for... Okay. That is what we are going to do. For those that did not hear class, my wish is for God to surround me with great people. Such wisdom. <clears throat> it's important at this moment for you to understand because what I've been feeling in the spirit that will prevent that is this Bible even of God? And what I'm proving to you without any doubt. So we'll start at, well, Jesus is here reading it. walked into situations and sat down with people. Well, Lord, I burned the Bible because of this. And this is in person. When you understand the historicity of the Bible and the YouTube documentaries being watched and that extent of the control a demon and a person has over that person, then you understand why the difficulty of that wish, while not impossible, requires finesse. <clears throat> so my first plan, we are going to war. <clears throat> Two by two and when you ask why you won't because you'll look at your kingdom marriage oh that's why that's why what I want people to understand about the kingdom of heaven you need to be looking at it as an entirely separate tribe that tribe being the entire lineage that the Messiah has to come from in me, Judah. So when prodigals are returning, and they are as we speak, because I want you to look at your prodigal as that was once Pharaoh in your life. And their heart has been unhardened and changed back to where it began in your lovely hand. Your prodigal gave you their heart. It would be against free will, justice, and God's way to allow <laughs> unforeseen forces to your blind prodigal be the resolution to what both of you, with me in your midst, as I am sitting right next to that guy on the bleacher, I just have not orchestrated his understanding enough to where he understands the one true God is Jesus. So glorifying God is what we are doing through all of these questions. And there is always a way to glorify God. And that is what I am doing. Undoubtedly, the Bible is of God. 
How do I know Peter was a fisherman? When I sat down with Peter, he told me that fish talked to him. And that's not crazy to me. So, that is my royal proclamation on that. <clears throat> Your king. Always. If you look at 1 Peter and 2 Peter, you see an extremely astute, intelligent individual. You see an entirely different story because the disciples are found in a boat You have an entirely different understanding when you understand what happened on the road to Emmaus. You have an entirely different understanding. I already have fish waiting. There's too much evidence to suggest that Peter was not a fisherman. What I've been trying to declare loudly through the beginning of the issues where why are you translating the Bible again and again and again and again? That is a lot of scripture to fulfill when each word changes. But you weren't dressed in a robe that was dipped in blood. Well, wine is a different color. What is he talking about? One scripture says his robe looked like he had just passed through a wine press. And yes, I have. It was a Adidas robe. <laughs> Not good things happened afterwards. Um, all around this city I was in, three other cities were destroyed. <laughs> <clears throat> so Peter was there Mary was there Mary saw it <clears throat> when you're unpacking and you're attempting to come up with your own explanations based on well it was in this language it was in this language this really means this what you're not understanding is that is coming from a idea and masqueraded as you are doing something good. The impact it is having isn't. Because I did not lead you to do that. Dig deeper and you will see a demon in that individual teaching the word of God. Have discernment and you will feel it. All of these reasons why this person's wish is a little difficult during a tribulation. A tribulation is designed to submit and cleanse. And he will cleanse the threshing floor. There is no way the gospel reflects the full fulfillment of everything John the Baptist said I would do. Rather, it states all this he did and more. I suppose if there were what if I was a record of all of his good works, there are not enough books in the world to contain them <clears throat> before the English word book existed. So <clears throat> while we let God glorify himself, 
You're welcome. And so there is no confusion. I am simply in husband mode. So many have stated, well, the gospel was a wedding proposal, but I tell you more. A conditioning, a familiarity, a walking with you from the moment of the final covenant. The resurrection to this moment. Understanding at the last day, I will raise you from the dead. So that you know the difference between life with me. But this easy to understand 2000 years of your being prepared for your bridegroom, beloveds. So each of you has a kingdom wedding day. <clears throat> And each of you needs to understand our traditions, our ways are completely different than anybody else's. We are a tribe. We are a kingdom with God on our side. This was specifically placed here for you, Mary. <clears throat> Her scripture, the blessing fell on Judah. That is what was promised to David to easily discern. A man after God's own heart. You have a man after God's own heart. You have a wife after God's own heart. You, that is from Mahasura, are spiritually more mature and older. Now, when you understand the false Holy Spirit and how it led you away, then you also understand the process you went through to come to the truth. All of the steps when you were stubborn and wise in your own sight. So I have video of me teaching Peter, all of those videos on Facebook, I have videos of me teaching Mary. Every single person has a different knowledge of me and understanding of me. You are purified, sanctified, and set apart for me. Now you are received by me. When I'm sending you out, I am not going to send you out until your kingdom reconciliation happens. So my kingdom spouses resist the urge that you may have to say, I was right, you were wrong. Now I want you to watch me celebrate because I was right and I am better. Rather, because of your walk with me, you have the compassion and understanding, testimony, and love. Not only in the, uh, I'm attracted to my spouse, but my heart hurts when my spouse hurts. You are one flesh. You learning to work together is now 
possible. Whereas before, why I kept many separated <clears throat> because of my experience. The devil and your spouse would wait until that moment where they were needed and then flip them around. And you would be left not only emotionally broken, mentally broken, your faith shaken in your God and helpless. Because in marriage, you are putting your life in your spouse's hand. That is the only way you get the full love that starts with your trust in So however you want to look at it from that Sid Roth video, <laughs> I have been gathering friends for God, making this lighthearted for you. Let's confirm. So, uh, now that you are listening, when you're coming back together, you are automatically going to feel different. Because you've been in each other's dreams, you hear love songs in your spirit, and this is my way, utilizing what is available in 2020, etc. <clears throat> After everyone was sent to their room to come closer to me. I just thought it man. <clears throat> you see your new life as the only life you want because you want to walk with Jesus. So you both having as much God in your life as you both are making decisions together as equals, the same thing I wanted in my life. <clears throat> but you understanding that I'm primarily going to hold accountable and the crucial decisions from the design of marriage, starting with Adam and Eve to the point where we had judges, I give that responsibility to the male. <clears throat> the fact that you are hearing from me in dialogue, in communication with God, understanding what I am telling you, and it's lining up with what I told you yesterday and it lines up through my prophets, and we have a remnant, and I have my people as the last are now first. And they've gone through the process of being resurrected, given eternal life, to help steward. And many of you were given a kingdom marriage that you did not steward very well. Prodigals, you were not faithful with little. You were not faithful with the stewardship. Your knowledge of God is still sufficient 
for you to be stimulated not only spiritually, spirit to spirit, but what has been placed in your life, what you have learned, your ideas, as you institute your own kingdom under with your king who remains faithful, believe and trust. Synonymous. God's name is Jesus. So, <clears throat> I can take someone with this version. <sighs> As simple as this one is. Why do you have it in the air, Lord? Because I got it from a church and I find churches to be completely dark right now. <clears throat> you really are the church. What are we going to do? We are going to save the earth. <laughs> this is what we are doing. There is a way to do it. And the fact that we have YouTube and God's words flowing through where people have already uh, accepted as normal things to do normal drugs to partake in, normal activities that are such an abomination against God. It's <clears throat> and this is normal. It was inevitable that we're going to be seen as the hate group. So we have a way around that. <clears throat> we have a kingdom. We're, we're part of our kingdom. We keep to ourselves because we already learned. Then they want to come to us. So having this trust in your kingdom marriage is going to prevent all kinds of falling away. It's going to confuse those without the spirit of truth the true holy spirit because the scripture says we prayed that our enemies would be confused <clears throat> that's a standard michael tactic <clears throat> 185,000 that time so viewing it through my eyes you know how safe and protected and secure you are one more thing We are in a season of restoration to kingdom marriages, healing, rest, and celebrating. The modern church, the next season will be spent on its knees. <clears throat> as I continue fixing this mess. So <clears throat> you guys worry about your marriages. I am here. That makes the modern church pretty much a place where my homeless people can be fed, warm, charge their phones, and whatever else they want to do there. I love you.